hair care basics for not so basic hair because our hair is not basic at all it's very textured and alive and it's it's a crown Hey my harmonies, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Symphony. I film beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content. And if you guys enjoy those types of videos, please make sure to like this video. And of course, subscribe to my channel to join the harmony. As you've seen by the title, I'm going to be doing a full hair review on the Bread Beauty Supply hair products. I'm so excited to be trying all their hair products for you guys and reviewing them and letting you guys know all the tea and the juice and everything about their brand. So we're just going to get right into this video. For the Bread Mud Mask, it says this is a clay mask but not for your face. It's a detoxifying pre-wash treatment for your scalp and strands for ease of application dampen hair before applying and yeah you just put it all over your hair and massage it in the scalp mainly so i'm gonna take about this much and putting it all over my hair and you mainly want to focus it on the scalp as it says because it is a detoxifying mask and that's where your scalp holds everything it does smell like clay too but it doesn't really have like a scent I'm like oh my gosh this smells so good it just smells like a clay type of scent and do not mind all the hair that's coming out because i notice like in my past videos people will be like oh my gosh you have so much hair coming out are you okay and it's like yeah i'm fine I just ain't comment in a while. I'm just gonna leave it for 20 minutes or so. I'll just talk to you guys when I'm about to use the hair wash. So I just rinsed on my hair and so far, this product did like moisturize my hair. I mean, it's good if you have like a lot of product in your hair and like old product that was like sitting in your hair for a while and you really need to detox your scalp. I'm really excited to try this award-winning hair wash, gentle milky hair cleanser for all hair types. I'm very, very excited to try it out. And it has argan oil and aloe vera and it's sulfate free too. I'm gonna take about that much. <laughs> dude this smells like a sugar cookie like a lemon cookie sugar cookie it smells like dessert oh my gosh i'm just gonna put this all over my scalp first since it's sulfate so free i don't really think it's gonna give me like a sudsy type of soap it's more like a co-wash like it said so far i genuinely do like how the products are really moisturizing especially like the mud max like that was pretty moisturizing but i don't really know personally if i would use it all the time maybe for like special occasions and for this hair wash it does feel really moisturizing because it has the aloe vera in it and what else aloe vera and argan oil so that's really good for hair and hair growth and all of that's just really good moisturization and I am going to be putting it on the ends of my hair since it is that moisturizing. You can still see my curl pattern when I use this hair wash. So that's super good. Hair care basics, not for so basic hair. Ooh, it gives you a good wash day. Hair wash is like marshmallow like cream. So it smells like marshmallows. Okay, still, still a sweet type of scent. It may help take care of buildup, debris without causing naughtiness crispy dryness mm -hmm. and stripping your hair of natural oils it's good on thick curly coily afro texture or dry hair now that i'm done doing that i'm gonna rinse out my hair with warm lukewarm water and i did the same thing with the mud mask as well so while i'm doing the mud mask and the hair wash i'm rinsing out my hair with lukewarm water then once i get into the conditioner i'm gonna rinse out my hair with cold water first lukewarm but then it'll get into cold like slowly because my body cannot not right now not during this weather. so this is how my hair looks after i use the hair wash and 
so far i really like it it's definitely a co-wash type of shampoo now we're gonna get into the hair mask and this is the creamy deep conditioner for all curl types and it has australian kakadu plum and star flower oil and i never heard of those two in my entire life honestly so i cannot wait to try this out and it says the same thing as the other one hair care basics for not so basic hair because our hair is not basic at all it's very textured and alive and it's it's a crown it's a velvety lightweight type of deep conditioner and if you want to you can section your hair into four different parts and then you leave it on for five to ten minutes add more water to detangle with your fingers or a detangling comb let's see how this works okay it's very thick i like that it smells like cake to me now because that one smells like a sugar cookie to me but it said marshmallows but this smells like a cake for sure like cake batter frosting mm. and this time we're going to start at the bottom of the hair since it is the oldest part of your hair and i'm just going to finger detangle a little bit before i part it into my two sections detangle my hair i'll link it down below for you guys i got it from aliexpress but you know that's gonna take like a whole month to get but they do have these on amazon and if you have amazon prime you can get this within like a day or two so yeah i'll just leave the amazon link down below i'm gonna put more product on the ends of my hair because they're looking a little bit extra dry. Just got out of the shower, rinsed out my hair. I had left the deep conditioner in my hair for about an hour. Because y'all, I, I got so freaking hungry. I was getting like very hangry. Or not even that. Like I got like a hunger attack. Like I don't know if I'm the only one. But when I get super hungry and I like hold it off. It becomes like an attack like out of nowhere i just get like ugh, like i can't anymore so i had to get out the shower eat i left it in for about an hour and i really love how my curls turned out this is what my hair looks like it's very very moisturized and the ends of my hair look popping so yeah that deep conditioner slash conditioner works amazing and i'm very particular about my conditioners because you know moisture is everything for us curly girls curly coily girls for the products i'm going to be using in my hair i have the bread hair cream elastic bounce leave-in treat your hair while you wear i like these little things that they come up with it's like very mm -hmm, like yeah that's right like yeah that's right hair cream is a silky soft styling cream that contains conditioning and repairing agents for semi-defined soft hold and hold the crust also it's not going to be crusty or anything while well, you have this in your hair it has mango butter grapeseed oil argan oil castor oil one thing that's a little bit eh, is that it spilled inside so some of the product was wasted not too much though but i love the packaging on this box that's really cute Mmm, smells like candy. And you guys know why I always add gel in my hair, but this time I'm not. So we're gonna see how my hair reacts when I don't have no gel in my hair. So first I'm going to wet my hair again since it did get a little bit dry while I was out. And look at the packaging though. Like I love how it has like that clean aesthetic type of packaging with this. Mm, it smells like candy and i love the texture of this okay i'm playing with it too much I'll take about this much all over my hair mm. 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of nervous for not adding no type of gel to my hair because gel spilled on the carpet but gel helps a lot with holding my hair so we're gonna see if this product really holds the curl like a gel but it doesn't give off any crustiness like a gel can I diffused my hair a little bit but I noticed it's getting a little bit frizzy up top which is normal because I have different textures in my hair and some parts get way more frizzier than other parts so right now I am planning to add the hair oil everyday gloss and this is very cute I love the packaging of this and it says it's like a lip gloss but for your hair and it has that Australian kakadu 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 Plum provides an anti-greasy pro glossy feel for the softest, smoothest, dewiest looking strands. So I'm very excited to put this on and I'm probably going to put a little bit on at a time then diffuse my hair. Mmm, it smells like candy. Maybe I should have did this after I was done diffusing. So it's been two days since I had the Bread Beauty supply hair products in my hair and I am absolutely loving everything because I swear I always have to have gel in my hair in order for my hair to cooperate but I have no type of gel in my hair. It's literally been only this bread hair cream that has really gotten my hair like this. Now I'm going to apply the hair serum but really quick I just really want to show you guys how my curls are really popping because of these products. I do have some frizziness but my hair naturally gets like somewhat frizzy no matter what type of products I put in my hair I notice. Last product I'm going to be using in this video is the scalp serum. It says cooling greens and it says a reset for your scalp. So let's see how this works. Oh and it comes with this so I don't have to pour it in my hand. Ooh, this looks different. Soil benefits from added nutrients for plant health, so to your scalp. Gentle enough for the delicate skin on your scalp, the tingly, cooling, dewy textured serum is like a reboot juice for the skin on your head. I'm just going to kind of massage it into my skin. It's good for all hair types, including protective styles like braids and cornrows. Ooh, it definitely gives a minty, cooling sensation add a little bit on the tip of my fingers that looked like a lot but i swear it wasn't and i'm add a little bit more to like right here because i've been pulling my hair a lot right here from wearing my buns i'm gonna go back in with the bread hair oil just to make my hair a little bit more shinier. Since I didn't add any today, I just mainly fixed up some pieces of my hair that were frizzy using the hair cream. So I'm just gonna add it to the front of my hair. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. the hair oil definitely adds more of a shine to my hair. I need some more and it's good for the ends of your hair too because you know the ends of the hair is very sensitive and us curly girls our ends need to be on point always I rate these products from Bread Beauty Supply a 10 out of freaking 10. And it's mainly because I have no gel in my hair. And my hair is not like poofing up. These products work so amazing. I highly recommend them. And 
the aesthetic of the bottles and like the packaging and everything is really pleasing to me if you guys are like into aesthetic things then you know what i mean i definitely recommend their products to you guys because i'm sure you guys will love something in their brand at least whether it's the shampoo the cooling serum the hair oil that really helps make your hair look shiny and popping um what else the hair cream yeah, the hair cream is definitely my favorite product out of everything i'll leave the link and all the information in my description box down below for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed today's video make sure you guys give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to join the harmony it means so much to me and thank you guys for 25k subscribers you guys mean so much to me and i'm just so happy that our little family is growing and everything so yeah, thank you so much for subscribing and if you're not subscribed already make sure to subscribe i love you guys so much and god bless you all in jesus name and i'll see you guys in my next video